Hey YouTube, I'm coming in to bring you an update on what's going on with the plants or the little seedlings that I put out in the garage uh, maybe a week or two ago. I did put them in these containers so they're not completely unprotected out here. In this first container, I have pansies. I'm like, and they look good. It's one container. It's the other. Pansies look pretty good. I have this helichrysum. There's three. This one is broken, so that's not gonna survive. And the other one that's laying down, she looks like she bit the dust. Behind that, I have Alaska Daisy, also I believe is known as um, Shasta Daisy. I have this Penstemon here, which they look pretty good. And this is a perennial in my area. So if I can have this make it out to the garden, that would be great. And I have these Snapdragons over here. And it looks like there's something else mixed in there because I see two different types of leaves and I've not grown Snapdragon before, so I'm not sure what is what. I'm gonna close that up. And in my Christmas container, let's see what's going on in here. Oh, I have quite a few things. Back here are carnations. And they look really good. I have some collards. Those were planted, it looks like, on the seventh. And they seem they seem to be okay. I mean they could be looking better, but you know, it is what it is. And I have over here. I believe this is broccoli. Nope. It's mustard. These are some broadleaf mustards. And these also. I have cabbage, the mammoth, I believe the red mammoth cabbage. And she looks really there's one that possibly will make it. What is this? This is the broccoli right here. So I have two, four, six broccoli. And in this container, this is where I had my stuff that I wanted to start for my herb garden. This in the first row is lemon mint. And this is peppermint and spearmint and lemon balm here in the last row. I also have kohlrabi, which it looks okay. And this is my orange chard. Right there, if you can kind of see that. I have these onions that I've been playing around with and they're looking questionable. It looks like there's some kind of um, mold or mildew or some sort of deposit, I don't know. So these onions probably are not gonna make it, but that's okay. I have a bunch of other onions planted and I also have um, some onion bulbs that are gonna be coming at the, um, end of the month or early March. So that's what I've done. Oh, also here. And I ran out of space down in the basement and I put some things, I was, I didn't have any more uh, containers, any more black pots or red cups. So I put them in the, the stackable planters and I have some bunching onion there. 
I put a tomato. This here is fennel. And what's this? Parsley. Put parsley here. And down here, I have um, tomatoes. because I was like, I don't know what kind, but it's called Tiger Stripes. And I have some calendula. It always looks questionable, or I, I don't know if it's doing good or doing bad. I can't tell sometimes, but I'm just gonna leave it here. It remains green, so I'm not gonna um, bother it too much, but I don't know, I might be kind of crazy because I opened the door to give them some sunlight. And the temperature in the garage currently is, let's see, 54 degrees. So, yeah. All right, the door's been open for a couple of hours and I'm gonna close it up and that'll be enough sunlight for them today. All right, everybody, thanks for hanging out with me and checking out what I got going on here in my garage. Thanks for watching. Bye.